Good afternoon, my Grip Tape friends. This is Jason coming to you with another update to our Comfy UI Grip Tape nodes. Uh, this was a request from one of our users who was asking about this, and I thought it was a really cool idea, so I figured let's give it a try. And the request was basically to make it so that uh, if you disconnect a display text from its input, that display text will stick around and not be erased. What was happening before is that if you did something like this and you said, delete that, and you made some changes to this and you ran it, it would basically erase everything that you changed. So what this change lets you do is basically use a run of your agent to generate some text and then allow you to make changes to that text later. I will demonstrate what that means. As you can see on my screen here, I've got a couple of nodes. I've got a run agent node, which basically will generate a prompt for an image generation engine right here. I then have the result of that agent, which is the display text node that shows me what that text is, which is telling it to create a photograph of a classic bicycle. I then take that output and I throw it into a create image from text node, and then I've got my image. And when I run that, that's what happens. If I disconnect this now, I can go ahead and make some changes to this text. So I can say, uh, instead of a classic bicycle, let's say um, pile of socks in the style of a vintage 1920s photograph image feature slightly faded color palette with warm nostalgic tones uh, and the socks should have a retro design complete with a banana seat let's just say a retro design add subtle grain and a slight blah 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 okay so now i have this new updated text like that and if i go ahead and run this you will notice that the text here did not change because it has been disconnected so it will maintain the text that you have there and the new image will come out with the socks. So the cool thing about that is if I want to keep this and maybe iterate and play around with different versions, I can go ahead and come back to this one over here, take that output, throw it in there, cue this, and you'll see I immediately go back to that create a photograph of a classic bicycle in the style of a vintage palette. So you can make lots of changes. You can iterate and try different things. There is that new one right here. Basically allows you to version control your prompts and work with them. We do love updating our nodes based off feedback from customers. So if you are trying this out and you have a suggestion, please drop into Discord, let us know what you think, and I look forward to talking to each and every one of you. All right, have an awesome afternoon. Cheers.